What are you guys' biggest icks? There's a lot. Why are you hanging out with my girlfriend when I won? Don't worry about it. If okay. I know this, if it's, it's like a girl's butt. Butt. just like. <laughs> <laughs> it would be so nice if we'd end this episode off with a little kiss. Oh, bro, what? They're going like to another oh, room right now. The they're they're literally leaving together. Just, to just want to let this story die and I'll be all right. We <laughs> can be friends. But I'd like to just be eaten. Welcome back to Unsafe Haven. Today we have Mr. and Mrs. Artaline. You said Mr. when you pointed to her. <laughs> we have Miss and Mr. Artaline. You Just miss? Isn't it supposed to be Mrs.? All right. R R so back. you can't even get your own joke right. Okay. All right. 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 Well, welcome back to Unsafe Haven where nobody is safe. You can probably tell from the last episode where you had Dylan walk out. We're going to touch on that today. Yeah, wait, before we start, can we just be like 100% clear? You're not going to walk out, right, on the pod? Okay, I'll try not good. to. Okay, all right, all right. And I'd like to start off with a question that everyone's been wanting to know. Let me pull it up. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people on the internet are saying you guys would be a good couple. What do you guys think about that? That's straight from your Instagram. That's straight reply? from my Instagram. Everyone wants to know that. I'll let Colette answer this one. No. <laughs> she just she re rejected him. Is he in the brother or friend zone right now? Friend? Friend. Well, I'm not her brother, so. Yeah, so when you put a guy in the friend it. zone, is there ever potential for him to get out of the friend zone? I don't know. You don't know? No, I don't know. Just think. Well, like, what? sure, I guess. I don't know. Have Probably you ever not. had a guy leave the friend zone? No. Have you ever had a girl leave the friend zone? Uh, yes. Yeah. Yes? Okay, well. For today's sake, I'm gonna assume that you guys are dating for the rest of these questions. We're not. And I'd like to start off with you guys' done. relationship rules. So say you guys were dating. <laughs> we're gonna ask you guys your relationship rules. Okay. Number one, parties, okay? <laughs> Gibson, start us off on how you think about parties in a relationship. Just, and if she went to parties. Just, just let me know. Just be like, hey, I'm going. Who are you going with? Okay. Same. Bye. I don't really care. Like, you don't have to tell me your every move. So, so what if your significant other is out at a party till 2 a.m. and they're not texting you? But they told you they're going. Sure. I would just be as like, as long as what? I could do the same. Yeah, yeah. As long as it goes both ways. I would be a little like, why are you out till 2 a.m. not answering me? Like, when's the last it's time she texted It's a good party. Me? It must be a really good party. When's the last time she texted me? Yeah. Like, two hours ago at 12. Oh, well, I don't know. Maybe she fell asleep. What's she doing from 12 to 2 a.m. at a party and not on her phone, though? I don't it's know. It's the trust. It's trust, but like, yeah. why are you at a party when you're when you're not single? Do you not trust Gabby? I do trust it, but like, it's respect. Okay, but who's there? Is it like it's like a party? Just a, a massive party. party. Yeah, a massive party. I I don't really care. I don't know. I don't go to parties, so I don't really like have this like. Concern. I don't really care because I'm not in a relationship. I wouldn't know. Yeah. All right. So what about also. other people? Would you let your significant other hang out with other people? Like other, 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 other people of this different gender. <laughs> yeah, sure. Of different gender, yeah, I don't care. All right, what if your boyfriend was hanging out with a girl that he knew liked him, or you knew liked him, That's and he still hung out with him? One on one? No, no. Or with like a group. group. In, a, in group. a group, I don't care. But one Even on one. if the girl one. liked him and was like constantly trying to flirt with him and didn't care that you guys were dating? Well, it's on him then to be like, no. But like, no, like reject her or like no hang out with her? If it's, if it's not one on one, I don't care. Dang. What if, yeah. your, what if your boyfriend's hanging out with a girl one-on-one, -on -one, though? Depends who the girl is. It depends. It's not yeah. an instant no? Yeah, it just depends. What if he's hanging out with your best friend one-on-one? -on -one? That's weird. But then my best would friend not, wouldn't do that. Who would it not be weird with, then? Like, I don't know. Like, I have some guy friends that, like, it's not weird with. It wouldn't be weird with, ever. Interesting. Is Gibson so one of those guy friends? Or is he, like, a little bit weird? I mean, <laughs> like, yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you like, know it that. wouldn't be weird, yeah. Oh. Yeah, she's basically saying that she, she's not attracted to you because it's not weird. That's so weird. It's not weird. All right, now your turn. Uh, your girlfriend weird. hanging out with other guys. I think every single question you're going to ask today is like completely situational. Like, mm -hmm. uh, okay, how would you feel if Gabby hang, hung out with me one on one? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'd be like, that. yo, what's going on here? But you know that I'd never like try to try to do anything there. Yeah. I'd be like, why are you hanging out with my girlfriend one on one? Don't worry about it. But well, why exactly. is your girlfriend We're hanging out a surprise with your for best you. friend? One exactly. One. We're yeah. planning a surprise for you. Buddy, buddy thinks he's funny. He thinks he's funny. But seriously, if Colette was hanging out one with one guy, what are you doing? Well, Colette's not my girlfriend. If she was your girlfriend, I said um, we're going to assume that she's your girlfriend. One on one with another guy? That's weird. 
Yeah. Yeah, it's weird. Okay. But like, what if he's like, you know, there's no threat. Like, it's one on one with a guy. But like, what if right. it just, depends? If it's what like, if I'm what if I'm at school and he's like, hey, want to go get lunch real quick? Like, what's the difference? What's the difference? Maybe if you guys are working on like a school project together and you have a reason to go get lunch. Well, what but if, if there's like, no reason to go get lunch, then it's like, uh, there's obviously like a motive there. Is it breakup worthy? No, it's not breakup no. worthy. Not even close. No, I feel like if you're I, mad I about it, whatever. Worthy. I don't care. But huh? like. Like, if you're mad about it, it's like, oh, I can see why you're mad about it. But it's like... Well, I would be, like, questioning it. And I would be like, oh, it's weird. But, like, definitely not breakup worthy. That's, like, a different story. Okay, I guess you guys are different than me in that area. But what about TikToks? Like, is there, like, a borderline of, like, TikToks you can't make? Or, like, what if your boyfriend is, like, making TikToks with, like, super, super famous girls for being attractive? Clout. Go get it. Go, Go get, get your bag. Clout. Yeah. Go get your Go get bag. bag. I mean, I don't care. As long as it's like, okay, say I was dating somebody right now mm -hmm. and there's like rumors about me dating him on the internet right now, I could see why you'd be mad at that. Yeah. Oh, but once again, yeah. I, don't, I don't know. If, it, if I know, there's no. What if, okay, it. you know you know Bryce Hall, right? Mm -hmm. And you know his snap stories, how he uses his girlfriend like as clickbait for the end of his snap stories. Like her sure, butt. yeah. So what if your boyfriend was like a snap, like a Snapchat guy mm -hmm. and he used another girl as clickbait for his Snapchat story? If I know the girl, I don't. He posts her butt on his story. I don't story. think there's a problem with that. I feel like if... I feel like it's more on him. Like, it's like... Yeah, your fans him. are going to think it's weird. But you wouldn't be upset with your boyfriend. It all depends on the snap. Like, how... If, I know the, if it's, it's like a girl's If it's just, like, straight on, like, that's the whole focus of the picture. Yes, like, it's just, like, trying to get views from another girl's butt while you have a girlfriend. I mean... Or what if, what if your girl posts another guy shirtless? Like, flexing. That's weird, right? Not really. If you're like, if you know the, if you if know you're the like person, at the gym. if I know, if it's like some random, are you guys like, like some like weird swingers? What? <laughs> no, it's like it's all situational, and we're also not in relationships, so it's like. Okay, I guess that's it for the rules for relationships. What about rules with kids? What would you do if you found your kid sneaking out? Oh, oh my gosh. I saw a TikTok about this the other day. Is, that, really? is this what you saw? Maybe, maybe, maybe. <laughs> if I caught my kid sneaking out, I'd be like, no, like, like you got to just like tell me. Like, I don't know. Wait, like, wait, quick, quick side note. How many kids do you guys want to have together? Together. <laughs> together is crazy. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> but how many, like, of how my many own? Kids do you guys want? Mm -hmm. Of my own? Probably like three. Three? Two or three. How many? Two. Two. Ooh, you guys both said two. She's like, Ooh, why are you making weird? <laughs> okay, we're gonna keep going with the kids stuff. If you oh, find your kid sneaking out, what are you doing? Um, like sneaking out is a big like no. Like, no. I, I would be upset. I'd be very upset. Well, what would make you upset that they're sneaking out? Anywhere, because I don't like know where you are. Okay, but would you be caring about the, what they're doing or just like for their safety? For their safety. Oh, okay, gotcha. And then what if you find your kid drinking at fifteen? Is it at my house? Is no. it like? They're drinking with their friends at like a party. I mean, saying I no. Like yeah, no. It's no, but like strict parents raise like sneaky kids. Yeah. I just feel like my kid wouldn't do that if I like raise them properly. True, true, true. What about like smoking stuff like that? Same as drinking. That's even worse. Yeah. Worse. I think sm smoking's worse because like I don't know. I just feel like it's worse. Yeah. I mean, it's all bad. And then sleepovers with their significant other. Would you guys ever let that? No. <laughs> no? It depends. It depends on the age. <laughs> Maybe like 16, 17, 18, but anything other, like younger than that, that's 15? a no. What if you're like, w no. what if your son's like, yo, can I have my girl sleep over? No. Like, no. We're going we're gonna to just cuddle strictly. No. no. My no? son is not. No. no. Okay. Enough with the kids. Enough with the relationship I've rules. I've had enough of these kids. Now the biggest it. icks. What are you guys' biggest icks? There's a lot. All right. Let's, let's hear it. she's taller than me. <laughs> <laughs> really? Is that an ick? Yeah. Are you really? sure? I'm sure. Yeah. Are you I sure? feel like I feel like as like a short a short king, you need you need a tall queen. <laughs> no. I think you do. No. Like your genetics are gonna be ruined. Not if she's taller than me. How would you ever, would you ever like, kiss a girl that's taller than you? Bro. What if okay, what if she's like two <laughs> inches taller than you? Maybe one inch taller than you. If I really like the girl, maybe, but it it I don't know. I just as long as I really like her. Okay. It's all about the personality. It's all about the personality. What's one of your icks? When your top three icks? Let's, let's see. I'm gonna hear both your top three icks. Well, I don't even. I giving, can't even think of it right now. If we're giving like serious icks, that's like not it. But my icks are like like being rude for like no reason. That's definitely mm -hmm. an ick. Yeah, like when they like make people storm off of podcasts. <laughs> yeah, that's such an ick. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I you have to like. I can't think of it. You said you had head. so many. Yeah, but like I just know there's a ton. But like. I'd have to like think. But since you guys can't think of X because you guys are uncreative, unoriginal, oh, you didn't even ask losers. I, I literally think, asked you. I have you. to think. I have to think. Hold on. Okay. <sighs> I could give you some. Okay. Um. Ugh, maybe I can't give you some. I 
you have any? <laughs> I don't know when they're annoying, when they're when they're lazy, <laughs> when they're unorganized, when they're lazy is a big one. Yeah, I hate Being lazy unmotivated, people. like if you don't it's not have about a job, motivation. That's one thing. Well, what do you mean by job? Like. Okay, if you're not making any money. Oh, okay, okay. That's, okay, obviously it's not, like, a huge thing because we're teenagers, but, like, if you don't even have the motivation, if you don't have, like, your, if you don't have your future planned out, but, like, if you're not thinking about it, that's an egg for me. It's not really it's about like, motivation, though. It's just about discipline. Because, like, I don't have the motivation to make TikToks every day, but I still do it, so. Okay, yeah, I guess. You have the motivation. He's like, hey, man, I just really want to dance today. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This guy's just lying now? But now that you guys are out of your icks because you guys are uncreative, I have a game called Red Flag, Green Flag. I'm going to give you guys some red flags and green flags, and you're going to tell me what you think of them. All right, is it a red flag or a green flag if the guy insists on splitting the check? On the first date? First date and then other dates. First date, it's fine, but, like... Second, first date's third, for, I feel like first fourth. date would be more important to I'd not. I'd like you to, but if you like, if you didn't think the date went well, and you don't want to pay for my food. That's fine. Yeah, that makes a little bit of sense. But like second and third, I'd be like. All right. What if you're dating someone for like five years? Do you expect them to pay no. for the bill the entire time? No. No. I'll pay for it sometimes. Interesting. What about you? I agree. Actually. You agree? Yeah. Would you pay for a girl if you dated for five years? Would you pay for every single time, or would you kind of like I'll split probably, it? Probably. Yeah. Yeah. I probably would. I mean, but I mean, nice. if it's like my wife and like we literally have like a joint bank account and yeah, like we pay our way. taxes together, like <laughs> it's well, yeah. like the family money. Like yeah, you know. true. If it's if you're joint account, that makes sense. All right, next red flag, green flag, swearing a lot. Colette, start us off. It's like it's a little bit of a red flag. I don't think it's like a flag. I feel like it's kind of an ick though. To flag. Like overly flag. doing it, like every other word is like that's too much, but. Gotcha. What about I you? What care. do you think about swearing? Yeah, it's honestly so <laughs> annoying when everybody <laughs> swears every, every word. All right, we're going to have to bleep that. I, 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 I regret that. <laughs> but So is it a red flag or green flag? Yeah, no, I mean, it's a red flag. All right, like, all right. It's, next. Not, it's not like a red flag, though. Like, it's maybe something I dislike. If they're doing it every sentence, then yeah, it's a red flag. All right, what about having lots of tattoos and piercings? What is a lot? Just like whatever you consider a lot of tattoos and piercings. Like If you, it's a lot... <sighs> I don't know. It can be, <laughs> mm-hmm. but not really. It's not a red. It's not a red flag. Okay. It has nothing to do with their personality. Maybe it's something you just don't like to see. Like maybe it's not something that's like your type. Oh, what about you? Green flag. Oh, you like that? Okay. I love it. Uh, you want a guy with piercings? What if a guy has like nose rings? Inch. What about ton rings? A ton. I don't care. I feel like it's another way to express yourself too. So I don't care. Nah, dude. Not gonna lie, in my opinion, I think it's weird when guys have like those things. Yeah. It grosses me out. Like, you know when people cut their tongues? Yeah. Okay, nah. that's I'm Yeah, are you care you okay with someone cutting their tongue? I don't know. That's just dangerous. Like it's like unnecessary I procedure. Need to cut my tongue. It's too long. <laughs> All right, show the camera your tongue. Uh, yeah. Show the nah, you, you have to. They can now. go to my they can go to my you to now. You show not to talk. <laughs> you can't say TikTok. that and then not show the tongue. Show it. Put the mic down. Show your tongue. Everyone, this is Gibson's tongue. <laughs> so awkward. <laughs> <laughs> look, look at that camera and do it too <laughs> Bro what Give, give us a double ton action <laughs> Alright That's a big ton Alright Is it a red flag or green flag If they ordered the me- off the menu for you Like they order your food I don't like that yeah, no. that's weird. That doesn't make any sense. They're like, you're gonna like this, and they order for you. I don't like it. Well, like it's that. like one thing if you're like suggesting like food, like you should try this, like it's so good, like mm-hmm. try this, try this. But it's another thing if it's like, like the waiter comes up and he's like, all right, what are you gonna get? Like, oh yeah, she's getting the salad. Yeah, what if the guys? What if you're like, I want a pizza, and the guys like, no, you're getting a salad. <laughs> Red flag. I probably wouldn't be on a date with somebody like that though. Oh, yeah. What about calling pe- each other pet names? <sighs> Like what if what if someone's like Bubs? Hey my widow, I hey my widow hate wabbit. that. It's actually like. Hey my widow wabbit. There's and so many people. We gotta lock the door, bro. There's so many people walking and around outside the why clubhouse. Why are we getting spied on? We're getting spied on right now. It's crazy. But yeah, pet names. You guys hate that? I hate pet names. Do you like pet know. names? Bro, if my girlfriend walks up to me and calls me her widow wabbit, <laughs> I would be like, what the hell? <laughs> her widow wabbit. That, the way you said that was so cute. I would Aww. be like, what the heck? Okay. All right. Clean. I mean, it's not like a red flag. I'd just be like, what? <laughs> You're weird. Yeah. <laughs> You're weird. Yeah. When they're not clean. That's a red, red flag. Red flag. Yeah. Yeah. That's like 
an ick if you're not like if your fingernails uh-huh. aren't clean what, did, what would yeah. you do if i said that's a green flag like what do you i do? would not live with you <laughs> <laughs> all right speaking positively about your ex about their ex like how often is it all the time that's weird it's like anytime it gets brought up it's like they were a good person i like, personally think like if they hate their ex so much it's like a little suspicious uh-huh gotcha hello <laughs> <laughs> they're just being right Why is she scared? So, we need a camera angle for all the people that walk by. Yeah, I think next should. episode, guys, we're gonna have a camera angle for all the people she walking at us by. And she's like, because it is, it is crazy. Oh, oh, phone. What if the, what if your guy or girl wants to say wants to switch phones? Are you guys, are you guys with that? Like, look at my phone. Yeah. Yeah, I don't care. Or what if they look at your phone without asking? That's like, as long as I'm, I'm not hiding anything. I probably yeah. won't be hiding anything. I don't mm-hmm. care. Yeah, I don't have. Like, you go to the bathroom reason. and you just walk back and they're just going through your phone. Well, that's a little weird, but like. Hopefully, you wouldn't have to do that. Well, yeah, but yeah. I'm saying if they do that, because then there's like a lack of trust. Mm-hmm. But mm-hmm. gotcha. And then posting multiple photos of you on social media a week, like posting you a lot. Is that like red they're flag? posting me a lot? Yeah. Like, does my girlfriend make TikToks and like we're making TikToks together? Like, that's that's different than like. Like no, the simpy posts. That's weird. That's like oh, excessive. like like the co- couples like TikToks. Yeah. That's just cringe. Also, to me. really quick, like I feel the tension here, so should I switch seats with you so you can like be a little closer to her? Bro. It's like I feel like I'm interrupting this tension. We're we're about <laughs> we're, like, before really we started like, filming the podcast, he goes, Yeah, you're gonna you're sitting there for now, but not for long. Like, you'll see. <laughs> and I'm like, bro, what? So like <laughs> No, I'm I'm you, get, I, I, I think, think this is my good side. I think you should switch, dude. This is my good side. I just I get, like I don't want to get in between all this Am tension. I taking over the podcast? Do I, if I if mean, I get to take over the podcast, this tension is taking over the podcast. I mean, like, if you guys just want to kiss already, just do no it. Tension. <laughs> there's no tension. There's no tension. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm sure. You sure? Yeah. Okay. No tension. I guess. I guess. Now, hypothetical questions. If Gibson <laughs> saw a girl mm-hmm. and she was walking by, and he was like, "Are we dating in this yeah, scenario? You're, you're okay, dating this. Got it. You're always dating. I mean, you're dating right now. <laughs> Anyways, he walking by and, a, and he sees a girl and he's like, "Yeah." You guys did. That is so cringe. Like that is so. Are you disgusting. breaking up with him or are you stay with him? Breaking up with him. <laughs> That's just so cringe to the point where I don't even think I could be with you. <laughs> can't be with you, bro. Bro, I'm not doing that. She can't be with you. <laughs> mm. right. What if I, What if it's a guy? What if I walk past and it's like? <laughs> That's. It's like, I guess it's kind of funny. Haven walks past. I'm like, All right. What yeah. do you do? What are you doing if like? Oh, actually, is this a red flag or green flag for a girl? If a guy's like overly gay with his friends. How gay is overly gay? Like literally gay? Like no, nah, not like literally gay, but like you know those guys that like like the cross country team when they're like when they're like all like just like doing weird stuff or like we don't do weird slap stuff. each other's butts. Like is that weird? I don't know. I <laughs> dude, you slap mine. <laughs> what are you on? Dude, I feel you... tension here. No, I feel tension here. <laughs> I feel a lot of tension here. So you did you did Gibson's makeup, right? Mm-hmm. How was that? Was I don't know like, if I would call I want you to do my make make make, make, make no. me a little girly no, pop. That was my idea. Oh, it was your that idea? That was my idea. Did you like touching his face and really getting close to him? Mm. Like when you like looked into his eyes and put his eyelashes on, you were like, oh my gosh, your eyelashes are so nice. Or, oh, your eyes are so she pretty. She did say that. She was like, she was like, oh, she I did, really I did nice say eyelashes. his lashes are long. Yeah, they're nice. Yeah. Could you, could you recreate how you like looked into his eyelashes? <laughs> I'm going to storm off the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Well, no, no more hypothetical questions, no more rules. Okay. Now we're going to go to everyone's favorite segment, the singing segment. And before the podcast, I gave her two <laughs> options, and she chose a Beyonce song, right? It's Ariana Grande. Oh, Ariana Grande. Yeah. Ariana Grande, so. <laughs> Did I choose that song? Because we I'm... can't be friends. Oh, all right, all right, all right. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get you the lyrics, so just so you make sure you know the words. You're going to put her over this, right? Yeah. Like her song, okay. Let's Brady, Are you gonna don't get put copyright? her over this and post. No, no please all do. Right, all right. You're gonna start at just wanna let this story die, and then I'll be all right, and then we'll all join in at We Can't Be Friends, okay? This is so awkward, this silence. I really don't like it. Can you join in? We'll join in. Can I start here? No, no, you start. It's so awkward. Just wanna let the story die, and I'll be right, and then we'll join in at We Can't Be Friends. All right, get ready. All right, let's go. Sing watching. it, like you have to actually sing it. Sing what it. they hear me sing? Just sing. Come on, every, you have to sing. Just wanna let this story die, and I'll be all right. We <laughs> can't be friends. Da, da, da. I don't know the rest of the words. Be ten. Be ten. Okay. You cling to your papers and pens. That's wrong. I don't know the words. I don't know either. 
All right, thank you, thank you. That took a lot of effort to convince you. Yeah, to why do that. is it always so hard to make girls sing? Oh yeah, I know we made this first little part of the podcast awkward, a lot of tension here. So I'm gonna go shift more. Where's the tension? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is the tension in the room? Yeah, I was trying to be nice and I was going to shift it away from that, but you want to keep talking about the no, tension? No, we can no, talk we about can, that. We can talk about the right. get ready with me. Next though. little segue <laughs> is we're going to talk about you, Colette, mm-hmm. and your whole influencer thing and like mm-hmm. being an influencer girly because I'm sure, I'm sure a lot of people watching this. I mean, I have a lot of little girls that follow me. No. Th- Pause. <laughs> but I don't mean it like that. Like, there's a lot of younger girls following me and a lot of them want to be influencers and you're kind of like a young girl influencer you do the get ready's with me she's a role model you do those talking videos tell me how you got into that tell me what you feel about them tell me how your future looks as an influencer well um i started my first video i posted a video of me like crying on the internet about my ex-boyfriend oh pause let's let's touch on that let's talk about your ex-boyfriend i I regret like doing that it was bro it was literally a two-month relationship it was not worth all of that like but look, what is it? Because I looked for that video when I was researching this podcast, it's and not I couldn't on, find it. Because my account got banned. So recreate it. Tell us what happened. I don't. I don't. Yeah, really start like, crying right now. Recreate <laughs> cry right now. Recreate <laughs> the video. I want you to go into depth about what happened with your ex-boyfriend. Um, I really don't like him. But basically, I dated. Wait, didn't him. she just say that that was a red flag if she like you like really hate your ex? Can we rewind to that? Okay, yeah, I did Wait say minute, that, but I'm not. I'm not flag? talking to my future man about and you're that. Okay. To Gibson, so you, you don't know but okay yeah so he broke up with me and like at 10 o'clock at night i wanted to i don't know i posted a video and i always wanted to do get ready with me but i was scared so i made a new account and then i posted like six videos that day and they all did super well and then i kind of just went with it and then i gained a lot of following on there actually and then my account got banned thank you tiktok oh and my then, gosh they banned everyone yeah i was at 400k like more than 400k and that's I'm, more than you have in your account right I now i know more than a year later i still don't have the same which whatever <laughs> i enjoy doing the content that's not why i'm in it for the following anyway um so yeah i posted that tiktok and i guess people just were like you're so real you're so real for this looking back on it i wish i never like I wish it didn't happen that way, but hey, mm. I'm I'm fine with being an influencer now because Are you it's like cry? no. <laughs> I thought I saw a tear for him. Sorry. So close. <laughs> why did you guys Why did you guys break up though? What, what happened? You tell me. I don't know. He I just never... randomly texted you. Yeah. There was no reason, no fight, no nothing. Mm-mm. He just like I don't like you no more. Mm-hmm. Dang. Okay. So it was basically it was Colette's fault, and she just doesn't. Basically, know all my fault. You know. Who's yeah. hotter, Gibson or your ex? And cut. You have the answer. We're live. What? Uh, you're going to clip this. But Maybe. I'll say Gibson just because I think he's really ugly. My ex-boyfriend's really ugly. Rate Gibson on a scale so 1 to 10. why did you date him? Because I couldn't tell you. Okay, next question. Rate Gibson on a scale of 1 to 10. Next question. Rate Gibson on a scale of 1 to 10. <laughs> um, looks only. Looks only? So you can be purely honest. This doesn't mean anything. I'll give him a seven. Wait, is seven or five mid? Is seven or five mid? What? Is seven or five mid? Five's mid. Oh, so you're above mid. That's still not good, though. You're giving him a seven? Eleven. He's an eleven. Ooh, she's giving you eleven. I think it's the green flag right there. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) All right, now give some right, Colette. Ooh. Uh, Six point nine. Oh, dang. He really did her dirty. Did her really dirty. But what's your favorite, like topic to make i know you're like an influencer girl you do get ready with me what's like your favorite like style because there's more than just get ready with me like what's your favorite type of content to make i just like when i can just like yap in yeah. my camera yeah. i don't really big yapper over here yeah base that's my bio i think actually oh, really? um i don't know i started off doing like makeup videos which i think those ones makeup yeah topic earlier Strawberry makeup. What is that? Can you please explain what strawberry makeup know. is? I'm, that's not even a question for me because my for you page is not get ready with me. I don't know why, but really? it's like I'm so out of touch with that world. My best friend tells me like all the trends. I'm pretty sure strawberry makeup was like Hailey Bieber. There's like blueberry milk nails. Like there's stupid things like that, but I don't know. I think it's just freckles and blush. Oh, okay. Have you ever done strawberry makeup? No, I have not. You should make a video on it. It's trendy. I think it was trending maybe six months ago. <laughs> no, I looked up. There's like a creator search insights tool now where it shows you what's trending on TikTok. And we don't know if that's thing. accurate or not. I think it's accurate. Well, but you made a video on it. <laughs> She's shaking her head. You made though. a video about it and then the video didn't do good. So. I didn't make a video about it. You did make a video about strawberry makeup. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. You told me you were going to. I was going to, but I never did. So you lied to me. Okay. All right. The girl is I just crazy. had an idea and I never completed the idea. Stop stepping on my wire. 
so are you guys fans like, of anyone like fans like hardcore fans hardcore fans or just like fans i'm a colette fan i have post notifications on oh i'm a gibson just- fan Oh, see, yeah, the, the tension's back, guys. The tension is back. <laughs> it's so cute. I just love my little Oompa Loompas. <sighs> They're like, it's like, I feel like I'm Willy Wonka right now, and I'm like witnessing like the future. <laughs> like, I'm like seeing it all in my head, like you guys are going to walk down where's the, the aisle. Where's the chocolate? And then everyone's going to be singing, like, instead of like a wedding song, it's going to be like, Oompa Loompa, doopa dee doo. Is there okay, any chocolate? Vocals? Hmm? Is yeah, of course there's cho- chocolate. Where? Did you prepare chocolate for the podcast? No, I should have. That would have been funny. If I had chocolate for you guys, you guys could like share it and like butt into it at the same time. What? That would be so funny. Next question. <laughs> that Next wasn't even a question. That was a statement. Moving Next on. Topic. Okay. What do you think about the studio right now? Because a lot of comments are like, the studio's mid. I mean, I'm working on getting a new thing. What do we think about the bookcases? What are we thinking we should do? And I want you guys to let me know what you think is like the perfect studio it's setup. It's literally a library. So yeah. What do you guys think about the studio? I think it's nice. It's really I insightful. Like we got sorry, we got we got a light now. I think that's very professional. Um, they can't see the light though. They just yeah. see the bookcases. Okay, but I can see the light. Um, we've got some guests coming in through the door sometimes. <laughs> At like all times. <laughs> that's funny. I mean, where else are you supposed to do? We don't have a studio. Yeah, we're working on it though. I want to hear what you guys want for your studio. Yep. Yeah. You do dual enrollment, right? That's mm-hmm. what I do. What kind of, how does that work? Because I know a lot of people know I do. I never really touched on it fully on how it works. So explain how dual enrollment works and if you recommend it to people. I love it because I don't have to go to my high school anymore. I have beef with my high school, actually. They might get me in the office for talking about this. Uh Um, But yeah, I hate my high school. I hated going there. I like, the vibes are bad, bad. So going to college, basically, is much better. You also get a lot more of like, choices on classes you get to take and my grades are doing better so the um, classes are easier because your grades are doing better i think the classes are easier than oh, my really? school classes Interesting. yeah but it is like i don't know it's better and your schedule is more free i only go to school two days a week like it's everything's better yeah, 10 out of 10 you're recommend. still in high school like a little, little guy sorry little that i'm grinding guy okay <laughs> we're gonna go back to a little bit of a daily vibe we're gonna be like yo guys what are your types you're asking me what my what type do you guys is? types are yeah i don't have a type i really don't think i do i just like a nice smile <sighs> this is your moment to shine what you know what to say <laughs> uh tall <laughs> no. dark tall hair brunettes. yeah light eyes uh, mm-hmm. yeah yeah that's that's what does it for me yeah dang no i, I don't know I, I don't really have a type either i don't think i mean as long as they have a good personality personality oh yeah humor Big personality, personality smile <coughs> emo would <laughs> I'm wait, kidding. emo yeah probably you date an emo person? i have a shirt that says i heard emo boys on it and what do you mean by emo like, like the black hair across the face no emo? not that kind of like emo. what's about emo like anime emo no like what, what, emo? The what girlies is emo? know the girlies know no no what what is emo <laughs> what the it's like it's not not actually emo not like literally emo but like alternative i don't know okay like, I, I know what she means or tom cruise Oh one or the other okay no colette's reposts pop up on my <laughs> party page or anakin and it's, and it's like, everything it's like every single big viral edit is oh reposted by colette reposted by colette reposted that's by colette. my for you page it's not get ready with me it's edits yeah yep oh. what was the most recent one there was um who, who was the most recent one it was like three to four days ago probably but, anakin no it wasn't an anakin one it's it always was, anakin i saw Haley bailey make a video about it i have no idea it's the guy with the curly hair. I don't know. I don't know whatever. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, Star Wars is so not, great. I hate Star Wars. Enough. What? It's, it's awful. He hasn't I've watched never even them. watched it, but it's okay, so then I'm going to force you, you to watch them when we're We're not, not happening. Colette, though, you have good eyesight, right? Yes. Do you have contacts or just pure 2020 vision? 2020 vision. So could we have Gibson like, put his glasses on you and like see no, how you see those? No, because they make my eyes really big. Let's just see what you look through Gibson's glasses, though. Let's I see already, it. Sure, sure I already tried them look, on. Look, Let's do it again. Put them on. Like, get Girl, I'm, on. No, I can't see. I'm going to look stupid. Now look at the Gibson's eyes. I know. They're so bad. Oh, my God. She looks like a frog with them on. Bro. Oh. <laughs> oh. I love the flirting. So cute. He's going to clip this. I'm clipping everything. I know. Yes, we're going to this off with what was your guys' first and now your final opinion on each other? Like when you first saw each other's content, what did you guys think of like when how I that first person would be? When I first saw her content or when I first now? met her? I first like ever saw her content. 
<clears throat> like first opinion on that and then how was meeting her and actually meeting like know what they are in person is like a difference between the my, content my and the person. first the first video i watched of hers was that flower video that has like th- over three million likes mm-hmm. and i my first thought was why is her voice so high pitched bro really <laughs> Yes, I didn't haven't got so? I haven't got that comment in a while. Didn't you say? Well, no, it's just because it's that video specifically. Like not your other videos, but didn't you say something about that? About my voice to being me? High-pitched? Yeah, you yeah. were like, yeah, Sometimes, I don't like that video. No, I don't like that video, but I don't know. It did well, so I don't really care. But I don't so, know. what's your opinion on her now, though? Compared that to my that voice is opinion? not high pitched. Not as high pitched or worse in person. <laughs> I don't know. You can't tell how nice she is from her videos. I guess. What about big, you? Big oh. yapper. She doesn't. She's like. You'd think that she'd be a little bit more extroverted based on her videos. That's a good way to put it. I guess, yeah. Yeah, gotcha. that's the best way I could put it. And now you, Gibson. Um, I'm I don't curious. know. <laughs> I saw his. I followed him through you. So really? yeah, because I followed your TikTok and then I saw him. I don't really know what I thought. I thought he was gonna be way shorter. Okay, the first thing I said to him when I saw him was. Oh my God! You're actually not that short at all. He's not that short at all. I thought Big he was gonna be. I thought he was gonna be four six. She's like, right now. I. <laughs> Keep going. I literally like his most. What is it? Keep the pinned Keep video. Glazing. The pinned video is like I'm four six. So I thought he was gonna be. Really She's short. the most gullible person I've ever met. Yeah, actually, I dude. fall for everything. Yeah. Yeah. That's uh, kind of sad. Know, but, but what do you think of him now? Now I think, he's short, but he's not that short, <laughs> and he's nice. He's nice. Mm-hmm. So nice. I think Gibson's so nice. Do you think she's so nice? You know, it'd be so nice if we'd end this episode off with a little kiss. Oh, bro, what? <laughs> okay. Anyways, uh, I really? think we're going to wrap it up there. I mean, the tension's getting ahead of me. And once we turn cameras off, who knows what's going to go down. <laughs> so I th- he keeps tapping me. She keeps tapping me. They're like, please turn the cameras off. I can't. I can't resist each other. I'm sorry. Well, I what? Know, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you for watching another episode of Unsafe. Thank you for watching another episode of Unsafe in the comments. <laughs> Thank you for watching another episode of Unsafe out. Haven. Let's storm off. I'm storming <laughs> off the podcast. I'm done. We're recreating the last one. Wait, let me grab my bag. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Tyler, you gotta move the camera. I'm catching the first flight. I'm out of here. You, you gotta storm off too, Colette. I'm going to Virginia to see Dylan. Oh my gosh. Um, Was no. no. This is unreal. They're going like to another oh, room right now. The they're they're literally leaving together. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh my gosh, they're leaving 